Welcome back gamers, lazy gamer here, and let's play some more Life is Strange, where I just confounded the um, trucker over here so I could take a picture. Actually, I could have done that without talking to him. I made the trucker happy, and I get to photograph this bitch in 1977. Later. Apparently I couldn't. That's a big tin for Max. Trucker language. And uh, bird and lots of ants. Look at that. So sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. More dead birds. So ominous. And a photo. Yeah, I know where this is from now. Uh, bit morbid, maybe. More dead birds. I didn't warn her or something. I hate seeing old women on the street like that. <sighs> nice world. What about men? Hi, how are you? I remember you. I heard about that girl almost jumping off the Blackwell roof. Kate Marsh. I was able to actually talk her down from the roof. That was you? Well, if I had a bottle, cheers. Thanks. Wish I had a bottle for you. But I need to find out who else is involved in this. I'm probably a bigger snoop than you. People pretend to not see me, so I see everybody and everything. Including Nathan Prescott? That spoiled shit finally got kicked out of his daddy's school. He also drugged the girl who tried to jump. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. Tell the truth, I guess. This is not a big uh, thing, a uh, uh, main uh, thing, but I might tell the truth anyway. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe, and you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. Thanks for the warning, Max. Not sure she believed me, but anyway. Um, let's look time. It's fine. Let's go inside and get uh, Frank's keys. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Yeah, you already have you already had breakfast. Anyway, he's over here. So <coughs> Frank Bauer stars in A Faceful of Beans. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm gonna try, but spilling stuff is probably not a very good idea. Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? Try talking to him. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. 
In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe well, I could I chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Well, we could try. No spilly. There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Black Bull for a while. And you for helping her. That's the kind of school spirit we need more of. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. Uh, no, I'm the one with the replays around here. <clears throat> By the way, there's news. Goodmont, that doesn't explain the recent extreme weather patterns. No, but we have to start with the hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather. That doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Dr. Hedora. Will your team know more after their latest tests? I hope we see more patterns, which gives us an atmospheric template. Many local residents of Arcadia Bay have been questioning what has been going on with this crazy weather. We had an eclipse yesterday, a snowstorm two days ago, which, as most of you know, is not common this time of year. It's unprecedented, to be honest with you. Uh, the last time that we had a snowstorm of this caliber was over 100 years ago. <coughs> All of us are questioning. What is happening in Arcadia Bay? Please feel free to call in and let me know what your experience has been. What you think this might be is this global warming. What is causing all of this crazy weather? I think that was mostly live video. Anyway, let's uh, deal with the cup again. Um, yeah. There she is. Thanks, Either Officer. That, I'm glad you're. That. Next. Prescott deal. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Let's try this with uh, Frank, I guess. What the fuck now? Chloe's debt? No. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Or are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother. But I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Feel? What the fuck now? Nothing. I just clicked. Error. Um, did I rewind enough? What can I do for you, Max? There she is. Thanks, Officer. I'm glad you're. That's it. Um. Oh, Nathan is there. Right. Oh, gosh. Nathan has time to get drugs from Frank because he was expelled. 
Rachel? Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. He seems a bit nervous. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. And rewind so that never happened. He doesn't really... I don't really want to talk to Nathan anyway. I still have the info. Which I can take... To him, I think. What the fuck now? By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? <sighs> Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. And I'll back off. Hello? What the fuck now? Yeah, sure, look. I don't think it was that difficult. Uh, maybe I remember wrong. Rachel! Uh, I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Only played this this part once before, remember? A bit hazy on the detail. Hey Frank, again. What the fuck now? Uh still no still no deal. Still okay. Rachel! Still. Blood oath. Weren't mm -hmm. you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. <sighs> That was the one I was waiting for, I think. So I have said that before, so... Again, I might be, be wrong. Anyway. Hey, Frank. Again. What the fuck now? You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh, uh, how do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told right. me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. 
Really? Yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know? Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here, judge for yourself. I can't actually look at the photo. I didn't try last time. But he took out his keys. The magic keys to Frank's RV kingdom. Take it and then rewind fast as hell because he doesn't like that. I'm afraid I'll have Thank to take you. your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. <laughs> Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys <laughs> now. Bye, Frank. That was sort of fun. If Key brought. <laughs> now back to Chloe. It would probably give me a smackdown if I if I didn't, but. Oh yeah, I also forgot that. Are you shitting me? Rewind. I didn't help her. Are you? Oh damn. Alyssa, watch out! Quit thinking, Max. Now I did. Whew. That was close, Alyssa. Okay, Max. This is the third time you've saved me from harm's way. You must be my angel. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. You've paid your dues by saving Kate's life on the roof. You really are a Blackwell hero, Max. I'm just glad she came down. Kate's a good person, my friend. And she was almost bullied to death by a video. It's fucked up, but you're an amazing friend. I want to make sure she knows how many friends she really has from now on. Amen to that. Max, we should get a posse to see her in the hospital when they allow visitors. Let's hang later and talk some more. Sure. Uh, I helped her again. I've been helping her all week. Uh. Deja vu. There's dust on the dust now. <laughs> Could take a picture of that as well. Anyway, there we have Chloe. Now, I really don't think I have the time to go through what well, I might have not that long a cutscene let's go and it can go over if it doesn't do it every time I should have known the amazing spider max I couldn't have done it without Frank now let's get <coughs> in and out you'll need this max On your mark, get set, throw! Not the road, I think. Parking lot. Get the treat, treat boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. I can harm him. Get it? I now can I can harm him with peace. But let's not waste time. Threw it out in the road. The doggy is or busy now, but road. he might come back. Anyway. Chloe and Max hitting the RV in the next video, I guess. <laughs> in the meantime, this was your host, the Lazy Gamer, logging off. Bye, guys.